Hi guys, welcome to another spray paint video. Today I painted this awesome little picture of Handsome Jack. Stick around to the end of this video, I'm going to show you some things that I don't like about this picture, some things I wish I did differently, and some problems I had while painting. If you like this kind of video, why not do one of these? Now let's get into it. So the final version of my handsome Jack picture, a yellow and orange I chose for the Hyperion colors, the sort of uh, handsome Jack's colors. With the vault symbol, that was simply a stencil with black over the background and then I used some plastic to get the textured effect uh, into it. Uh, really happy with how that turned out. The stencil itself, on this one I tried a spray glue technique instead of weighing the stencil down. Took a couple of different spray glues to find one uh, that didn't leave a residue behind. And if you're interested, the Sikaflex Spray Fix is the one that I settled on. 
The other couple that I used were some Accent Bond, a Bondle or something. Um, I don't have the cans here. Adam from the future here. Just editing this video and I talk about spray glue on the stencil as a way to hold the stencil to the artwork. And I really regret having it in this video as a pro. While I was painting this picture, it worked fantastic. But every single picture I've used spray glue on since this handsome Jack picture, I have had nothing but problems. But I just wanted to pop in now and uh, just make this claim that I do not endorse spray glue on the stencils. It certainly works if you're doing it on a vertical or 3D object but not if you're trying to do a picture and certainly not if you're trying to reuse your stencil. Other people may have a different experience. This has been my experience because in this video, it comes off as a good way to fix a stencil while you're spraying. And I just wanted to clarify that. Let's get back into it. So some things that went poorly with the application. On the first layer, I had a bit of lifting on the stencil through this area. With the light gray layer, the second layer in this, in this case, I put it on a bit too quick and um, got some lifting where the paint was quite thick, where this vault symbol is, which I, which I touched up at the end with, a, with some paint on a palette knife. And some other problems I had were some holes within the stencil, so where the colors didn't overlap. Uh, and that's a stencil design problem, uh, not an application problem. Uh, out of all the paintings I've done so far, this is the one that I am the most happy with the overall outcome. The techniques that I am learning are stacking and uh, I'm starting to get the results that I'm desiring. Uh, le let me show you some problems I had getting to this point. So this is my first attempt using the Handsome Jack stencil. I had some issues with the spray glue that I mentioned, uh, the residue sticking and not being able to be removed. Um, I was very disappointed with this color scheme and I mishandled the picture. I don't know if you get to see that there and actually scraped the stencil over the clear coat. If you can see uh, through his shoulder here, the green, I don't know if you get to see that. Um, where the stencils don't overlap and I had to paint those by hand. So not happy with that, but it was a good learning curve. Second attempt was this one here. I tried a similar color scheme, trying to incorporate all the Hyperion colors uh, with the stencil itself. Really good application on this stencil. I was a bit unhappy with how his eyebrow transferred over and I tried to hand paint it in. And um, I actually, mixed some gray on top of some black and got a really bad effect there but overall um this turned out great i just uh, i just really wasn't happy with the blue at the bottom there then this was my third attempt so very similar to the final piece that we saw in this video uh, but i rushed it and i put my second stencil down before my first layer was completely dry and the stencil stuck to the paint it wasn't worth trying to lift this off and pursue with the picture in my opinion seems to be the problem i have consistently is not to rush so i actually got myself an egg timer to make myself wait between layers so that's going to do it for this one thank you guys so much for spending this time with me i'll see you in the next one